Laura No Nizzle here with Mr. Richard Schiff. Is that how I say it? Schiff? That's how you said it. But it, but it's S-C-H-I-F-F. I want to make sure. That's correct. Yeah, you don't, you don't want to change the dialogue of that last name. It's, no, that wouldn't be good. I'm notoriously yeah. terrible with last names, so I'm just going to try Schiff. All right, and Mr. Michael Olson, is it? That's correct. Yeah. And apparently this is who the film festival is about. Well, we're part of it anyways. We help to finance the films, get them to this point where they can be showcased and get audience participation and feedback. And everybody loves it. Well, that's what it's all about back here in the social media geek lounge where we're processing all of this stuff. And you, sir, are a fine We just actor. had a power fist over there from one of the guys, one of the geeks. Hey, hey. Geek power fist. Geek, geek power, power fist. There should be another symbol other than the power fist, don't you think? It's like, what's the start the Trekkie symbol? That would be, you know? I can't do it because I'm not quite... There you go. That's it. much better. That's good. Well, that, that's the geek symbol for tonight. So what are you gentlemen doing back here in our geek lounge? Well, we're we're hiding. Uh, we're actually we're actually uh, we're actually charging our phones. Believe it or not. Charging your phones, and it's just an essential well, part we of. Get back of to meet you guys, though. We want to talk to you. And this That's is the, the most important. You know, we figure it's an important thing for us to share with you more about the inside of the industry and how people get so they're so excited about film. Well, if there's anything that us, or all of the people out there in the interwebs need to know about TIFF, that they wouldn't know, what is that? That this room actually exists. And we are in Toronto. I know it looks like, you know, Romania. <laughs> but we're actually bit. in Toronto. Uh, I don't know what, I mean, I, I'm learning, I have, I've been here a few times before with films and always have a great time. Um, uh, as I was saying before, to, um, to, to the guys, uh, I come here and I don't see the films that that you can see uh, with my kids, you know, back in LA or New York or wherever. I, I see the films that I will never find anywhere else. Our film here that we're uh, premiering is called Daydream Nation with Kat Dennings, Josh Lucas, Andy McDowell, uh, first time director uh, Michael Goldback did a fabulous job. And uh, we had a premiere tonight for over a thousand people, standing ovation. It was excellent, got great feedback, and we're excited about it. So it's good. It's, where was that at? That was at the Ryerson Theater. Very nice. Or Ryerson Theater, or something like that. Ryerson. I'm going to talk now. And, uh, my, my, uh, my, <laughs> and I'm uh, here with a film called Made in Dagenham, which is an English movie directed by Nigel Cole. Nigel. Cole, and it's with Sally, the wonderful Sally Hawkins, and Bob Hoskins, and Miranda Richardson, and Rosamund Pike, and myself. And it's um, a, a very, very entertaining and, and, and good movie about the first women's strike for equal pay, which happened in 1968 in Dagenham, England. And um, uh, that's at the, I think the, uh, it's at a theater tomorrow sometime. Yeah. But uh, go look for it uh, when it comes out. It's actually very, very, very good. And the Infidel, which I d did. You, you these guys, did you see it? Yeah, yeah. Did you like it? You heard it was great. You heard it was great. Friends in Australia saw it and heard it's great. Yeah. It's a big hit in Australia. It's a big hit in the UK. Six people have seen it in America so far. <laughs> but now it's going to be eight. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. It's a very, very funny uh, uh, British comedy. I just happened to be in it because I was, you know, uh, in England at the time. And um, uh, it's, uh, it's a comedy about a, a Muslim man who finds out that he's actually Jewish. Um, so it's a bit controversial, but very, very, very funny. I don't do commercials well, but go see it. They're going to hire him instead of me. Pete, are you on Twitter? I ask questions that, that people our age don't understand. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Very nice. Twitter. Thank you so much, guys. <laughs>